For the first time in Northwood, the city's fire department now has full time firefighters on staff. Yeah, earlier tonight, three of them were officially sworn in at a pitting ceremony and Steve Iwanek, he went to the ceremony and spoke with those who were there. So Steve, what does this allow the department to do differently? Yeah, well, Jeff Kelly, the Northwood Fire Department, they don't just respond to calls here in Northwood. In fact, they actually provide mutual aid to three surrounding cities as well as the Toledo Refinery Company. So officials told me that the hiring of these full time firefighters will help ensure that safety is a guarantee. Welcome aboard full time. I should say. Three new badges in Northwood and for the first time full time. It's really going to be beneficial to us because we're going to be able to dedicate that um, at least one person's going to be around, but our minimum staffing is going to now be up to three people per shift. State your name. William Hatter, Amanda Hughes, and Noah Cornelison all making history, becoming the constant in a staff of over 40. Extra hands now on deck at all times for Fire Chief Joel Whitmore. It was really hard to fill those shifts. We had, would have gaps in coverage, and uh, it was just it was just a, a struggle to maintain that staffing. So, by allowing us to to get that person extra person here, we just ensures that we have somebody available. Whitmore says previously he's only had two minimum per shift, a mix of part time and volunteer, but the phone never stops ringing. As of May, the department's website says they've responded to 556 calls in Northwood, but also in Oregon, Perrysburg, and Toledo. Everybody has that need and just just like nobody wants to do it anymore. It's, it's, it's tough work. But now an extra call for help can be answered at any time. It's a really cool feeling, but uh, it's even better for the department itself. Uh, this is a bigger accomplished goal for the city. Uh, we couldn't be more happy for the city in general. The city is really the one who benefits from the full-time full department members now. It also brings joy to new volunteer firemen. 19-year-old Northwood native Adam Schroeder was sworn in alongside two others on Monday. Part of a big day for a small city. Knowing how small Northwood was and is still, um, it's truly great that we can finally have, you know, full-time um, firefighters serving their community. New faces, some finding a new home, others staying close, working a job filled with honor. I found something that I finally enjoy and I like and I have a lot of people around me that just care about the community and I like caring about the community as well and helping the people who need help themselves. So it's a, it's awfully rewarding. The money really doesn't matter when you're helping the people at the end of the day. Now, Wilmore also said the department received a safer grant from FEMA back in August, and that's a grant that goes nationwide from FEMA to help provide departments the ability to hire more staff. Wilmore told me that his grant's about $940,000, and that will be going, all that money, going towards hiring three more full-time firefighters in the near future. Reporting here in Northwood, Steve Iwanek, WTOL 11.